What's up, YouTube? It's your boy, The Flyest Trucker, you know, back with another video. Uh, today, we are going to review the Silver Bullet. Uh, just uh, posted the haul, the pickup video uh, for this and the other pair that I have. I have two <clears throat> because of the situation, the way it worked out. But let's just get right into it. Um, we're coming short of time. I have the Nike Air Max 97 OG QS and QS I learned a few weeks back it is for quick strike quick strike meaning they come and they go <laughs> now it's a short very small amount of pairs that are due like uh, you know Foot Locker got 12 pairs this uh, champs got 13 pairs finish line didn't get them quick strike so very limited very limited very limited comes in your standard Nike uh, box brandings as usual everywhere we have uh, the size eight and a half because they run small uh, colorway is metallic silver and varsity red retail 160 I thought it was 170 I was so wrong I'm so happy to be wrong in those cases this gentleman here paid one for 160 we got a $15 off, 145 plus tax, back to 156 Basically, pay for his taxes and a few more dollars. That's what I'm talking about. I do that all the time. So, here it is. Bang, bang. And by the way, oh, I am wearing a size 9. I am a 8, as you all know. Size 9 does fit better and I'm able to put in the sneaker shields that allow for uh, less creasing or not creasing at all. I will try this on and maybe in the next video just shout it out really quick. Uh, maybe I should have did it before I made this video but you know it is what it is. Um, <clears throat> it is a nice nice shoe has 3M running all through it or at least the upper well all through it. I will do an on feet of these shortly. After that, you can almost see, let me see how bright that is. No, 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 no. But um, we have a black bottom, a little silver uh, bulb here with the Nike swoosh branding on it. Um, nice, nice black traction in this rubber. It really is. I mean, I wore them and walking, I tripped because it caught grip too much, you know. Uh, so I brought it up. I shouldn't have, but Nike Air on the back. Pull tab there. It's a small pull tab. But this slips right into your foot, no big deal. Uh, Nike branding right there on the swoosh. Nike, the, the, the ones that you do see. Very small, very subtle, but when you're out there, it's it's pow. You know what I mean? Especially like I have today, I have just all white and gray. Uh, no other pop of color. So when you see me or you look at the shoe, you definitely see that pop of red pop out. So... Uh, you have your zoom, your, your your air unit almost all the way 360, and then your zoom running through it, uh, your pockets. Very nice in that silver color also. Um, now this midsole, this white midsole, I hate it because it kind of oxidizes is the word for it. I don't know if it's the word for it, but it might be. It just turns black and brown and ugly and dirty really quick without you actually jumping in mud and dirt and stuff. So... Uh, that's one gripe I had about I would have about them. I have other colorways and they do the same. Barely wore them and they look like absolute crap. Um, let me see what we have inside here. Rope laces is one thing. Got the mesh uh, tongue. The whole tongue is 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 mesh. Uh, just a little swoosh there in silver. I mean this is a very very nice shoe. Very classic shoe. I can almost pretty much say this can be a grail of mine if I had grails then the next best thing this would be it I am a huge Air Max fan you guys see and know my collection of Air Maxes uh, I love anything that has a bubble all the way through let alone the bubble the small bubbles right I like that so can you imagine what I feel about bubbles all the way through and goddamn on feet they're really really nice and, and walking around people notice so there you have it uh, really uh, BS review as I do all the time but you know more of a here it is if you want to go check the resale market if you want a pair it wouldn't be a bad buy try to keep it at 240 239 that kind of stuff like that shipped if you can do that 
it, it's steep, but you have a pair that actually goes for it. It's worth that. The market on these is pretty damn good. So if you get anything under that, there you have it. If you get it for two, for 180, 190, and you wear them, you can probably still get that. You just gotta keep them mint, man. It's you know, things go up and down. You wanna wait till the hype dies down, then maybe you can get them for two, two ten. But because I feel the way I feel about them, I would go to two thirty nine. Um, there you have it. The ninety seven OG Silver Bullet. It's your boy, the Flyest Trucker. You know, if you like this video, and even if you didn't like the video. Still give me a thumbs up. Why not? You watched it. Give me a thumbs up. It takes a second. Comment down below. Let me know what you think of the Silver Bullet. Will you cop? Will you not cop? Um, let me know. Holla at your boy. Um, I'm missing something. I always miss something. But let's just leave it at that. I can't take much of your time. I'm running out of time. Uh, be safe out there. Happy Easter to all. Good night.